The next option that we're going to look at is to be able to, to scan in what we call a whiteboard. So whether you're actually um, drawing something on a piece of paper or something and you needed to be able to send that to a colleague so that they could understand what it is that you were trying to describe to them, you can use Adobe Scan to do that. So we're going to click on the little um, camera icon again. This time we're going to change it to whiteboard. Right. As we click on the capture button, we're going to make sure that we select just the area that we want. Right. Of course, you can go and manipulate the edges as you see fit. Right. And we're going to then go and say continue. I'm going to click on the little number one in the bottom right hand corner and you can see I have my document set up the way that I want it to. At the top you'll see that it says whiteboard. As I showed you previously, you can go and clean up any of the edges that you need to be able to clean up and clean up some of the stuff that you need. But you can also choose to rotate any pages. So if you're scanning documents and you notice that it's not always the, the um, orientation that you want. You can change that at any time. And of course, you can always come in and crop it a little bit further, depending on what it is that you need to be able to do. Once you've done that, you're going to say save PDF. And you will notice with a whiteboard, the same as with a document, it will then give you the ability to be able to comment on the document. Thank you for watching this Adobe Scan tutorial. Here are a list of the other episodes in the same series in more detail.